Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Hope you're having a fantastic day. Malakunk here, and welcome to Day R Here Alien Abduction Horror. So basically, this game is meant to be like a alien game in a like horror. It's really, really unique, and I've never heard like anything like that to be honest. So I was like, guys, we're gonna check this out. We're gonna go into this. So yeah, uh, hope you got your snacks. Make sure you watch the end because uh, yeah, it's gonna get intense. Yeah, let's hop straight in. All right, unexplained uh, anomia occurred at Grayswood Farm on the night of August 7th. The Sherman family witnessed bright lights in the sky that moved at a breakneck speed over the cornfield. The lights moved in a random direction at different speeds. After a while, they vanished. This strange behavior in the sky was observed at the same time each night for five nights. According to the owner of the farm, the animals were crazy. The dog became aggressive, tried to attack him, and bit him. The children complained that someone was walking under their window. Farmer Peter Sherman himself in the field saw a strange figure that did not look like a man. Uh, what is it? Deliberate deception? Drawing attention to its own self? On a sensation about an alien invasion? Journalist Taylor Fox travels to the Grayswood farm to take a photo and make report of the local newspaper. Okay, so we seem to be on a farm and something's going on, which is probably aliens. We're gonna see some aliens. <laughs> These visuals are looking nice. All right, sounds like they're pulling up in a car. Well, I guess we were just in a car. Oh, we are. Oh, these are pretty good graphics. <laughs> oh, so, oh, are we like investigators? Yes. Like trying to get like a news report then? Ooh. Click left mouse button to take a photo. Wow. Okay. All right, this is really cool. <laughs> I can't even lie. All right, our car back there. Sherman's house. So this is the house they wanted to go. Uh, wanted us to go into, right? So we're going to go through here. I don't want to get jumped by aliens, please. Don't jump me, aliens, okay? Oh, I can... Oh, oh what is that? Hold up. Someone... What the hell? Someone just took a bite of a Snickers bar. I heard it right over there. All right. Oh, hello. Oh, a phone. Oh, no. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's just uh, put that back now. Whoa. Okay. That door doesn't open. Um, okay. What does work in here? I can hear like drips of water. Okay. Anything in here? Hello? All right. Just a child's bedroom. What's on here? A photo? Oh, that's creepy. That's real creepy. It looks like the drawing was made by a missing daughter of the farmer. The leaf is printed on both sides. Oh, wait. Hold up. So this side's like all friendly. The opposite side is a dead dog crying girl. So the alien's got blood on his hands, so I take it these aliens are bad. A walkie talkie, can I have this? Uh, apparently it belonged to the missing girl. If you listen closely, you can hear very strange sounds. Uh, property of Negan? Is that the little girl's name, Negan? Did I read that right? Okay. Okay, we should not touch that. All right. All right, let's check the other room, okay? The hell is on the TV? Oh, it's the alien. Oh my God, look at them. They're freaky. All right, uh, it's like a blurred face. Anything on the back? Nope. Uh, photo from the internet. Perhaps Peter Sherman saw something similar. It looks creepy. Uh, oh, they all just say the same thing. Okay, so this one's like a doctor printing on like an alien. Like three pictures of an alien. Um, what is this? Ugh. Ooh, I don't like the look of that. Uh, Father's Children's Diary? How could I forget that? Diary text. Today was the most exciting and scariest day of my life. I saw alien! My parents think I'm lying. But it's true! I was fishing from my abandoned pier on the river. Suddenly, I was defended by a roar coming over behind. I turned around, very low above the ground, was a huge disc with four flashing lights or windows. Was hovering, I felt a punch that seemed to throw me into the air. I froze there as if zero gravity. Everything around me became blindingly bright and I seemed to lose consciousness. I remember seeing three aliens with grey skin and big eyes. I was placed on the table as if I was wielded to it. They were standing over me and I seemed to communicate with them over telepathically. Then one of them came over and did something to my head. I don't remember anything else. I woke up on the pier later in the evening and barely made it home. My head was buzzing and I walked home as if I had a delirium. When I got there, I found several cuts on my body and two small, very smooth holes behind my ears. What was that? I'm scared to sleep. So they abduct you, they do something to your brain, they chop you up, put what? slits and holes in your ears? Why? <laughs> oh, I don't know. I, I feel like I'm going to turn around and an alien just going to be like, what's that? Oh, farmer's note. Okay, I really can't read that. Oh, it says on the right. Basically, they can be described in the following way. A large head disappro uh, disappropriate to the body, no hair, bottomless black eyes, gray skin, long thin limbs, and sharp claws. Their voices are nothing else. These aliens are very aggressive towards people. It all starts to bright lights in the sky near home, which move along a certain way. Then people start to have a nosebleed and then severe headaches and then buzz in their ears. Animals start raging next people to have a memory lapses periods when they don't remember anything. When they come back to normal, they find themselves in unexpected places. For example, 
in the middle of a field or on a road and a few kilometers away from home. Some of them have flashbacks and terrible memories. People remember terrifying experiences that aliens established control over the minds and has affected with their psyche. Also, they found the marks on her body, inclusions to be exact during appellation. I felt like something thick like foreign object moving around my skin. Oh god. Oh, this looks so real. Hello? I feel like I'm gonna get abducted. <laughs> oh, I can tilt. What the hell? So they only abducted this family? Okay. I'm, I'm kind of I'm kind of getting nervous now during the night my daughter heard a strange noise when I wasn't in her bed the windows are wide open conducted by those things I think I read this one oh no hey wait I'm gonna get abducted no no I'm getting abducted <laughs> oh no all right okay lovely I'm using a flashlight now hey hey Pigs! Hey, get out this house. Get out this house. How'd you sprint? Oh, this door is open, so we clearly need to go to the death door. Oh, never know. Hold on. I want to read. I want to read. Uh, as a child, headaches begin to bother me. They torture me to this day. I went to the doctors dozens of times, but no one could explain the reasons for their occurrence. And recently, strange, unpleasant things, tingling sensation in the back of my head have not started as well. Now I understand why the doctors could not determine the cause of migraines. The answer is simple. Abduction. I only remember the alien abduction when I found my old diary. It was migraines began... Then cuts, I noticed them behind the ear. There were trace of them. I'm sure I've implanted something in me. Uh, the, some kind of transmitter or implant because of this. I forgot everything. I definitely decided I would get it. I'm not crazy. Okay. Oh! Oh my good. Oh no, 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 no. Go back on. I don't know what I've done. Oh, it's a, it's, it's a, it's a movie? Okay, we're watching a movie? <laughs> All right. Uh, where's the alien? I don't, I don't know what's happening right now, guys. Um... Uh, the hell? He's invisible. He's he's a half. He's half a body. What the hell? I'm scared something keep, is gonna come behind me. I don't like it. Okay, so is this like space? Ah! Ow! I just elbowed my ribs. It's huge. You are a big boy. LeBron, that you, huh? Okay. What just happened? I'm running to my car. I'm going to my car. Bye! Bye! Okay, it was good investigating the place. I'm, I'm, I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Oh! Ah! No, 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 no. Run to the car. Yes, run to the car. You're not abducting my bum. No! Nope. Behind me? Better not be. Okay. Uh, car? Go in the car. Alright, we getting out of here? I'd ra Can I drive? Oh, did I get to drive? I want to drive! I love driving! And you forgot to gas it up, you dummy. Okay. Is my car getting abducted? Oh, that's big. Oh, that's a big, that's a big, I was gonna say plane. What is going on? Well, I'm dead. I was too busy looking at the spaceship. Oh, it was only a demo. I only get to play that much. Anyways, guys, that's going to be the end of their, uh, They Are Here. Uh, this is just a little short horror game, but, like, it was in, like, an alien version. Which I found really, really cool because, like, it, I like when, like, you get unique horror games. Like, you never ever hear of, oh, aliens in a horror game. Like, you never really hear of that. That was actually pretty scary as well. I didn't really like that. <clears throat> that was actually really making me, like, on edge while I was going for that house. But, uh... I wish there was a bit more, but, um, I don't know if I'll do this when it fully releases, but, uh, I might, you never know, depending on how well, how much you guys want it, basically. If you guys want it, you know what to do. Like the video, also subscribe if you're not subscribed, and turn on the notification bell. Uh, but yeah, if you guys want it, you know what to do, like, and, uh, yeah, that's up to you guys. And, uh, yeah, hope you guys all really enjoyed this, and, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out.